Uh, Jenny Gilruth, MSP, Minister for Transport. So I'm Laura Main, I'm part of the project team for the Edinburgh to Fife, Perth and Dundee project. So we're here today to launch uh, the first stage of investment to decarbonise the Fife route. Uh, it's hugely important investment, it's £55 million pounds worth of Scottish Government investment and the first phase of investment will take in from Haymarket out to Dalmeny and then looking to decarbonise the Fife route more broadly. Well, work is now underway to install a number of piles between Haymarket and Dalmeny and this is the first part of work that will be undertaken um, as preparatory works to electrify the route. Other challenges that we have is there are a number of bridges that will require some intervention strategies and we'll be undertaking a number of track lowers along the route as well. Also in 2023 we are looking to do additional work up in the upper parts of Fife, uh, closer to Kirkcaldy, Thornton Junction and up towards Ladybank. This represents another key step in the development of the project on the ground. All in all, we're looking at just over 100 kilometres of electrification. So this means that we can introduce battery electric multiple units quicker onto the network if we undertake this partial approach. So partial electrification means we can bring the battery electric multiple units onto our network quicker and therefore enabling Scotland's railway to become cleaner and greener faster. It's a hugely important investment in relation to the Scottish Government's ambitions to decarbonise our rail network by 2035. Work is of course already underway on the East Kilbride line and we're looking forward to consider the Borders line too and the procurement for the trains that will run on Borders and also on the Fife route is already underway.